and roll, my friends. Eric Andres, your guitar sage here, and today we're gonna learn how to play Rio by Duran Duran. What? But this is a pop song, Eric. I know, dude, but those Taylor brothers, they play their instruments very well. In fact, this song makes me want to be a bass player with that, that get down section in the middle. It's pretty hot. So here we go. I'm going to teach you how to play the guitar part though today. And as you can see from what I did just now, really there's two parts. There's that intro section where I'm doing the double stops, two notes at a time, right? With the slide down. And then there's the part where I picked up that, that fun little uh, device here. It's called an Ebo. Now you don't have to use an Ebo. You can, you can use a pick uh, for this part as well, or feedback is even better. Uh, but I'll, I'll tell you about this in just a moment uh, when we get to that part as well, okay? So really there's two parts to this song and here we go. So the, the first, um, actually this whole song could be played on the first two strings, on strings one and two. Literally, pull the other four strings off, throw them away, you don't need them, okay? Here we go. All right, so um, by the way, the, the sound that I've got right now is the uh, Les Paul R8, the Gibson Les Paul R8 uh, opened up. It's on 10, uh, pickup one or the, the, uh, the bridge pickup, and that's running through an uh, OCD full tone OCD, and then into my Fender Blues Junior. So that's how, that's how I'm getting the sound here today with a little bit of reverb. And I've got the drive at about half, okay? Okay, so, and the amp is real clean, okay? In fact, this is what it sounds like without it. That's, so that's all about the OCD pedal, okay? All right, so here we go. Here are the double stops in the beginning. Okay. This is going to be at the seventh position. First fingers on the seventh fret, second fingers on the eighth fret of the second string. And so you're going to play this once. Okay, I'm going to turn this down just a little bit. Okay, then this part. So the only thing you're doing here is you're adding your second finger. So now both fingers are at the eighth fret. That was three times, and then okay. So this is how it's gonna go. The first lick is one, two, three, four. Okay, that's the first half of the lick. One, two, three, four. The second part of the lick is gonna go. Let me, let me play this in real time. Here we go. Um, two, three, one, two, three, four. Okay, so basically there's, there's two riffs. And the first part I just showed you, so the second part is going to start off the same. that slide down to the fifth fret and slide back up to the eighth fret so really it's just memorizing that pattern and I would suggest to learn it by learning the two parts separately okay so I'll play it one time through more slow second lick When you're sliding, just slide down to where it sounds good, you know? Maybe the third, fifth, fourth fret, just to where it sounds good, okay? I don't try to think so precise. Sometimes I'll see that when people are saying, where do you slide to? Well, there's definitely a specific place, if it's a recording, where that guitar player slid to, but use your ear. It's just something that, uh, these little nuances that are better to, to start getting by ear as opposed to having someone tell you, okay? All right, so that's really the, the verse part of the song. Then we got the chorus here where I'm using the Ebo. What is this? This is called an Ebo. It's about $90. You can find this in my Amazon store. The link should be below this video. These are magnificent. They cost about 90 bucks. And what it does is it, uh, it's got a switch here on the side to turn it on. It's got a battery inside and it electrically vibrates the strings like an electronic bow, hence the name Ebo. And you get some really cool sounds like this. <laughs> Yeah. 
pretty cool, right? Um, so that's what an Ebo is. Now you don't necessarily need that thing, but we're gonna be using it. So you could just use a pick. Now, if you're going to do this, whether you're using the Ebo or you're using the pick, what you need to do is use your finger, be playing on your fingertip, but use the sides of your fingers to mute strings one and three because you're only playing the second string on this particular lick and if you're muting strings one and three it's going to make things uh, go a lot smoother okay all right so um we got uh this is the first lick so we got fifth fret so these are going to be the same frets every time so i'm not going to tell you every single time i just want you to observe but basically the target frets are five uh 14 12 13 and 10. So 5, 10, 12, 13, or sorry, 5, 10, 12, 14, 15. And we're going to be doing some bends. So this is lick one uh, out of four licks. So we got. Lick one. Lick two is going to go like this. Use your ear when you're doing these, okay? Lick three is gonna go. Lick four is the same as three. So really you only have three licks here, so lick four. Okay. Now, real quick tip about the Evo here. I'm playing, this has a switch. When you're holding it, in your, if you're a righty, if you're holding it in your right hand, you'll want to switch the switch down. If you switch the switch up, it has a little bit more of a, of a harmonic type of sound. I hope I've got that right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I do. Uh, either way, if it's not, it's the other way around. Uh, one produces a higher, a little higher overtones. Uh, but in this one here, it really doesn't go into those higher overtones, at least on the recording. So there you go. My friends, I'm Eric Andreas, your Guitar Sage. I would love to help you play guitar. If you have any questions, please leave them below. Any comments, tell me I suck, tell me I'm great. Uh, but whatever you do, hit subscribe, hit thumbs up. I'm on Twitter, Facebook, and all those places. Would love to help you out and have a free course at yourguitarsage.com slash 30, as well as a free ebook at Your Guitar Sage, and a plethora of other stuff that I give away if you sign up for that ebook, including my book. Uh, that I give away every year. My friends, please let me know how I can help. And as always, be kind to all beings. Don't trust the man and practice your guitar. I'll see you.